organisms or microbes. These are many small living organisms which are invisible to the naked eye. But they can be seen with the help of a compound microscope. The science which deals with the study of microorganisms is known as microbiology. Common features of microorganisms they are seen in every kind of environment. They reproduce freely and independently. Some microbes are helpful, but majority are harborants of microbes. Microorganisms are present everywhere in air, soil, water, foodstuffs, sewage and waste as well as inside animal bodies. They are present at great depth in the oceans, in streams, in snow of polar regions, in hot springs, etc. The maximum number of microbes is found in natural substrata rich in organic food, having a suitable temperature and moisture for their growth and multiplication. They can survive extreme conditions of temperature and dryness by forming a cyst which is a hard outer coat. When favorable conditions come, they emerge from the cyst, multiply and go through their life cycle. Critical growth of microbiology. The existence of bacteria was first established by A. V. Leeuwenhoek. Later, three scientists, Louis Pasteur, Robert Koch and Lord Lester did remarkable work in the field of bacteriology. Louis Pasteur, known for his famous germ theory of disease, which was later proved by Robert Koch. Louis Pasteur is therefore known as the father of bacteriology. Viruses were first discovered by a Russian scientist named Ivanovsky in 1892. In 1935, W. M. Stanley, an American virologist, first isolated the tobacco mosaic virus in crystalline form. Edward Jenner developed the technique of vaccination. Alexander Fleming discovered penicillin, an antibiotic from fungi called Penicillium notatum. In 1902, Sir Ronald Rose reported that malarial parasite, Plasmodium, is transmitted by female Anopheles mosquitoes.